Let's take a look at optimizing toolpath to reduce the size of the CNC program. This is a great feature provided by one CNC and it's available for both two and a half axis and three axis toolpaths. Let's start with two and a half axis toolpaths and let's select a pocket operation. I'm going to quickly select all three of these pockets. That looks good. We'll right hand mouse click. I'm happy with the tool parameters here. We're using a half inch diameter end mill. Speeds and feeds look fine. Depth of cut looks good at minus 100 thousandths. We're going to be using high speed close for this. That looks fine. Let's click next on that. We're going to approach using a helix. Next, next, and finish. Let's let one CNC generate the toolpath. Now let's take a look at three axis toolpath. Let's hide our upper plate. And let's come over here and we're going to go into our three axis toolpaths. Let's use Z level rough for this. Now again, I'm going to be using a half inch diameter end mill. Speeds and feeds look fine. Clearance values looks good. High speed close looks fine for that. All this looks good. We'll click next, next, and all this looks great. So we're going to select our boundary and once again we'll let one CNC generate the toolpath. Very good. Now let's see how long our CNC program is here. We're going to right hand mouse click and we're going to go to post group. I'm going to be using a Fanuc style post processor for this. Let's post this out. Click save. I'm going to overwrite the CNC program there. And let's scroll down to the very bottom of the CNC program and see how long this is. So we can take a look that this is over 11,000 lines of CNC code. So to be exact, it's 11,253 lines. Let's quickly exit the text editor. And I'm going to edit these operations. I'm going to right hand mouse click, edit the first operation. Now remember, this was our two and a half axis pocket operation. And what we're going to do is we're going to activate optimize arcs. This is a very powerful feature and when possible one CNC will optimize the toolpath into arc moves. This is going to reduce the amount of CNC code as well as maintain excellent part finish. Let's click next on this, next and finish. We're going to do the same thing for our three axis toolpath. Let's head over here, right hand mouse click, edit operation and I'm going to quickly push through these dialog boxes until we get to our arc optimization. Let's turn this on next and next and finish. Let one CNC generate the toolpath. Alright, now let's generate our program again. Going to right hand mouse click, post group. Again, we're going to be using the same exact post processor. Let's post this out. Again, we'll overwrite the CNC program. And remember last time our CNC program was over 11,000 lines of CNC code. If we take a look now, it's just right at 3,772 lines of code. Very, very nice. One CNC has the powerful ability to optimize toolpath, to reduce the amount of CNC code, and yet at the same time maintain great part finish. Thank you so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you in the next video.